This is the inside of an instrument voltage regulator, sometimes called a constant voltage regulator. And this is in a 1962 Thunderbird. And these were used from the late 50s to the late 70s, as far as I know, to control the voltage to the instruments that needed 5 volts. Um, it's a very primitive little device. It has a coil that's wrapped around a bimetallic arm and as the coil heats up and cools down it makes and breaks a circuit and that circuit is approximates about 5 volts we'll move to our voltmeter here which I have set to 10 volts and the only way to see this is with an analog voltmeter. You can't see it on a digital voltmeter because the response time is too slow. But you can see how the thing is bouncing around. And somehow it seems to average out about 5 volts. Although it doesn't really look like it's doing that. Um, I have it set to 10 volts so you want to read the bottom scale. And as you can see it just pulses back and forth and if you look at your instrument voltage regulator you'll see a little choke or coil attached to it and the reason for that is that as this thing makes and breaks a circuit it can induce noise into the DC circuit so the coil is put there to reduce radio noise so there's a better way to do this and that's with a little silicon chip called a 7805 voltage regulator. They're available at Radio Shack for about two dollars and I'm going to show how we can do that um, in my next uh, tutorial.